Hello Hectugors and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I will unbox brand new digital multimeter and I will show you how to use it. It's a O1 18E digital multimeter. Because it's a brand new digital multimeter, the first thing is to insert the 9 volt battery that is included in the package together with small screwdriver. To mention that O118E model it's with a Bluetooth function and it's a true RMS with 20,000 counts. That is the best thing for digital multimeter. With the rotary switch you can choose one of the functions that can measure this digital multimeter and the first one is DC or AC voltage measurement. Next is measurement for millivolts, also for DC or AC currents. This position is for resistance measurement, continuity test and diode test. Capacitance measurement, frequency measurement, you can measure the temperature with the probes that comes together with the digital multimeter. We're gonna see that later. This is nice feature. It have non-contact voltage detection. Measurement for micro amps or milliamps that can be measured up to 600 milliampers. And the last is measurement for amps and the maximum amps you can measure is 20 amps to mention that uh, digital multimeter have a bluetooth function and to download the app just scan the code after downloading the app to turn on the bluetooth of the device just hold this button Nice feature that this digital multimeter have, it's a LED backlight with a flashlight at front. How to use it, the digital multimeter, I will show you in next minutes. The first thing is inserting the, the probes. The negative lead goes here and the positive where it says for measuring the voltage, the resistance, hertz, capacitance, temperature, diode test. digital multimeter have nice holder so you can place it just like this and if you want to measure DC or AC voltages you select this 
the multimeter is ready, it beep it, and let's measure this battery. 9.3 volts. Let's say that I want to check this adapter, does it work properly? You set it on DC or AC voltage position. The negative lead goes here and the positive right here. And gives 9 volts. That means that the adapter is working great. Let's say that I want to test my power grid and measure AC voltage with the rotary switch need to be on position voltage DC or AC and select AC voltage. Two hundred and thirty two volts. Great. Let's choose continuity test, resistance and test for diodes. For example, I will test this yellow LED. I'm gonna select diodes, negative to negative, positive to positive, the LED light up and on instrument says 1.8 volts voltage drop. Okay, let's test it, the diode. You need to Place the probes like this, negative to negative, positive to positive, and we have a voltage drop. That means the diode is okay. If you want to test the wire for continuity, does it work? Select continuity. It will beep and show the resistant, resistance of the wire. Okay, let's test it the resistor and you can select auto one end of the probes just like this and other here. 74 ohms. The resistor is fine. Beside the basic measurements of the AC and DC voltages, continuity tests, this model can measure capacitance and frequency and have auto power off. The multimeter automatically enter in sleep mode if the rotary switch is not moved or not pressed on or not press at any key for 30 minutes. Let's say that we want to measure temperature. You select this range, remove the probe leads, insert this one. And to mention that can be measured from minus 50 up to 400 degrees. Where is it? Here it is. 26, 27 degrees. Great. The best function that have this digital multimeter is non-contact voltage detect without using the probes. Wow. It's working great. That is a nice feature. Now I'm gonna show you how you can measure amps and to see how much current is it's pulling some device. Like this LED. This is 100 watts LED. For that purpose, in package with the Multimeter comes two alligator clips. And you need to remember that if you want to, to measure currents 
greater than 600 milliampers, you need to choose amps and the probes goes ground here and the positive lead goes on 20 amps. You can see that the LED pull around 1.2 amps and it's very bright. To mention one more time that this model of digital multimeter have a Bluetooth function. You can control and see the measurements on your smartphone. It's a true RMS with 20,000 counts. Have a great LED backlight and more info and where to purchase this digital multimeter just visit the link in description below I hope you learned something new today if so please share and like the video great product